already by now there is expectations in the market of a deposit rate cut of 10 basis points and also an expectation that ECB will buy more government bonds, probably 10 billion per month. So these expectations are already in the market and we expect little impact if these are the only two measures ECB will do. Actually, we could see a negative impact to equity markets. Other options for ECB is to go deeper on the deposit rate cut and also buy more government bonds. We don't think that these two options are highly likely as if they introduce further deposit rate cuts that will actually start hurting uh, banks and also buying more government bonds and remember most of the core government bonds have very little impact due to already very low yields and also less liquidity in the markets. So if we look at the option for buying more government bonds, they could have an impact if they actually start buying uh, more from peripheral countries. So we will see a <coughs> contraction of the uh, peripheral spreads to core bonds. That could be one option. This will have a positive impact on peripheral countries and we also expect to have a positive impact on uh, equity markets, although uh, limited. ECB could also introduce a new kind of long-term refinancing operation, which will have a positive impact to banks and the financial system. This will have a positive spillover to equities. Furthermore, one of the most uh, unlikely, but now seem more likely thing is that ECB could buy corporate bonds and financial bonds directly in the market. This will have a big value and with little action could actually bring a big impact to riskier asset classes. And also remember to target what ECB is actually trying to target, the uh, functioning of the financial system. One more option ECB could consider is buying ETFs or equities directly in the market. This will have a very strong impact directly and instantly to equity markets and other risky assets. Also, it is still highly unlikely that ECB can go down that road now, as this is not part of the mandate yet. But still, signaling that this will be an option for ECB definitely would give a positive impact to the market.